Hi guys, thanks for stopping by. I am the Unfrothy Mommy, and today I want to come to you to share a teeny tiny, so I say teeny call. tiny, because it's not that I haven't wanted to go out um, and buy anything, it's because I really haven't had any time. Uh, if you've watched my last two videos, then you know that my family and I just purchased another new home. So I have been, we have been busy, busy, busy buying things for the house and unpacking and things like that. So I haven't really had a whole lot of time. Um, but on those rare occasions where we were out and I was at a, in a store possibly getting something for the house and there was a store next door that I um, could run in really quick, that's what I did. So let's take a um, look at some very popular things. right now. I love them. I love anything that Ray-Ban makes. They are just classic, classic um, um, eyewear and I'm really looking to increase my collection. I have a couple of other pair but it's I had so timeless, to just so again, just so classic. I just love the aviator look. I'm looking forward to um, heading to the beach this summer with my family and just being out and about doing normal things and um, sporting these. So I just love. Next them. up, I purchased the Coco Chanel Mademoiselle scent. I've never tried the Mademoiselle scent. But according to the young lady at the counter, um, it's very popular. And I didn't get it because it's popular. Don't get me wrong. I did test it out. I'm and just I looking forward it. to adding this to my um, already growing collection of scents. So keeping in line with the Chanel theme, I decided to, while perusing Amazon one night, to go ahead and pick up the uh, Chanel coffee table book. I love the photography and the colors. They're so vibrant in the book. It's a really, really beautiful book. The really good counter, the young lady, after I purchased my Coco Chanel Mademoiselle scent, gave me this scent right here, Sexual, Sexual Fresh. For my purse, there's nothing like, you know, smelling fresh on the go. And she also gave me a couple of other little just samples to kind of try out. So that was really sweet of her. So in Target, yes, there was a Target that was next door to something that we were getting something for the home for, so I decided to run in. I picked up my all-time favorite, Ambi Fade Cream in the Oily Skin Formula. I love this stuff. I have been using this since, like, college, okay? Um, because of the move and all the things that go along with moving, I haven't had an opportunity to replace some of my things. So when we were next to the Target, I decided to go in and kind of stock up on the things for my face and skin that I've been missing. I love this. If you get a blemish and you know it fades and it leaves a scar or you have hyperpigmentation, I love this fade cream for that. So always, always rapid always. tone repair for the night for nighttime. I love this. I have about six bottles empty laying around. Um, that's how much I love this stuff. I'm gonna do a video on my empties, especially for my skincare. Um, this is definitely a staple product for me. Again, I've been out for quite some time, so I was really happy to be able to go in and uh, also, pick up I needed some bottle. more Aveeno. I use Aveeno, Neutrogena, and Oil of Olay interchangeably, so I was out of this. So, again, took the opportunity to be in the Target to pick up another bottle, and I'm sure you all know what this is. I've used it for quite some time, but it's the Skin Brightening Daily Scrub. It has very, very, very um, fine light exfoliators in there, so you don't have to worry about doing a whole lot of damage to your skin um, with the um, exfoliators. So this is really good. I love this. Again, I've I used it for I quite some up time. in Target was just some holding spray. Um, I need to get the Sally's, but I don't really live all that close to a Sally's, so I just took the opportunity to look through Target and found this suave extra hold. It says it's going to hold for about 10 hours. You know, when you're wearing your units, with it being a little bit more hot and humid outside, you want something that'll give you a little bit hold, a little bit more hold. So I picked this up. Not sure how it's going to work, but. I'm hoping it'll do the job until I can get to um, Sally. While doing some internet shopping late one night, I decided to stop by my favorite online shoe store, and that would be DSW. And I picked up a pair of Nikes, and these are going to be for working out. I can never, I can never have enough pairs of sneakers to work out in. I go through sneakers like, just like hotcakes, like they don't last. Um, and that's a tip too, ladies, for you that are starting your workout regimens. Your shoes are very important, however, they do break down after a while. You can't continue to work out in the shoes that you had five years ago, they, especially if you're working out running or, you know, doing some of your high-impact aerobic um, 
exercises, the shoes will break down, so you do need to replace them. So I was happy to come across these. Uh, Nike, they are a gray, white, and like a fluorescent pink, if you will. So really, really, really looking forward to wearing these. And I didn't really see any um, athletic shoes in the women's section uh, online. So I went over to the men's section and I found these. I am a nine and a half in men's, I'm 11 in women's. So you can do that as well. If you don't see some of your athletic shoes that you like, head on over to the men's department. So I can't wait, however, able to find a cute little pair of pumps. I haven't purchased any, you know, semi-dressy shoes in a while because, again, we've just been moving, moving. So I was happy to come across. Powery, shimmery gold type of front here, and I love that. I love the little cutout detail here in the back, and these are by Moda. But I really love the heel. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. And I have a new camera set up, so I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be looking, so I do apologize if my eyes aren't in the right place. <laughs> but I love the heel on the shoe. Really looking forward to hanging out with my friends again this summer. Um, I haven't done anything with anyone because, again, I've been moving, so I'm looking forward to throwing these on and hanging out and just having a really, really great time. I also time. came across this Michael Kors pair of slip-ons while on the DSW website at the bottom of the shoe or at the top of the shoe that Michael Kors has become known for and they're just so comfortable I know I just said it but they're just so super comfortable so I'm looking forward to wearing these in the fall listen I am not rushing through the summer weather I want it to stay warm for as long as possible however I do want to be prepared for when the weather starts to turn kind of cool so these were going to be great and they smell so good. They smell so good and again, they're just so, so, so super comfortable, so soft. So looking um, forward to wearing The last these. pair of shoes that I ordered from DSW are these cute little braided sandals. You have the braided detail here on the front of the shoe and then there's some braided detail going all the way around the back. And I love them because they have a little toe here for your big toe. If you're like me, and you have long finger toes, then having this little cutout here in the front for the big toe kind of breaks up all that toe action in the front. So love these, love these. Looking forward to wearing these with some cute shorts or a maxi dress and again, just hanging out and being normal, no more, no more moving, no more packing That's stuff. It. This I hope you've enjoyed this teeny tiny little haul. And so until next time, ladies, don't be a frumpy mommy. Bye ladies.